one player who has been in the headlines in the last week and I guess has been in the headlines in previous transfer windows is a certain Victor Ossiman. Now, he's actually said that he's decided on the next step of his career already. What's your understanding of his next step? Um, in in uh, in uh, his re in his uh, renewal of contract with Naples, uh, he he talked to to his uh, chairman Aurelio De Laurentiis, and obviously De Laurentiis uh, gave him uh, an important salary, uh, very high, uh, and and I think that all all the two parties uh, uh, they talked about the future, and even even uh, Naples know that it's difficult to uh, to get to to. Um, to keep uh, Aussie men for another year in, in Naples uh, because he received a lot of offers last year and, and De Laurentiis said no. So uh, I think that Aussie men would like to go. Uh, he, he, obviously, he had uh, the possibility and he will have the possibility to go in Premier League. I don't know if it will be Chelsea or Manchester United, Paris Saint-Germain uh, too. So uh, they, they agreed if, that if we will arrive an offer uh, of around uh, 100 million, 120 million, Napoli will, uh, will think about that. There is an exit close of 150 million of euro, so I think that this will be mm, the possibility for him to, uh, to go uh, in, in the summer, but with a high price. Because if he didn't renew the contract with Naples, uh, Naples uh, uh, should have uh, sell him for 50, 60, 70, not so, not so much. With the renewal of the contract, uh, now Naples will earn from his uh, uh, departure uh, the, the right, the right uh, amount uh, of the value of Victor Ozyman. And, and then another thing about Naples and Premier League, we are waiting for the official announcement of Den Donker from Aston Villa to Naples. He's in, uh, in Italy. He had medicals yesterday. We are already, only, we are already waiting for uh, uh, the signature and the announcement, uh, obviously, is done. Luca, I, I must just pick you up on what you said about Ossiman there, though. Two things. First of all, the release clause, 150 million euro, and the name of the chairman, uh, Aurelio De Laurentiis, who always drives a hard bargain. Given that they've renewed his contract, but given that they put this release clause in, whoever does come in for Victor Ossiman, do you feel they will have to go to the release clause to sign him? Um, I think that uh, the, the offer should be uh, close to this amount. I don't think that Naples will sell Ossiman for 70, for 80, for 100. No, I think that the, the offer of a Premier League team or uh, Paris Saint-Germain, uh, the offer should be very, very close to the exit close. If it's 130 or 140, I think should be OK uh, to let Aussie men uh, go in another, in another uh, place.